Beginning tonight with a cold case from 1994, authorities have a confession from Samuel McDowell, who claims he killed Denise Brothers in 1994, right here in Odessa. Fox 24's Haley Brooks joins us live. And Haley, what are the authorities saying about Little? Authorities say McDowell could be one of the most prolific serial killers in American history. Samuel McDowell, a.k.a. Samuel Little, claims he has nearly 100 victims in several different states. Here's what we know. Back in 1994, Denise Brothers was strangled and left into, in a field here in Odessa, and her murder remained unsolved until recently. Samuel Little was being housed in California, convicted of three murders in L.A., when he confessed to a Texas Ranger about killing brothers. Brothers is only one name on the long list of victims. Samuel Little has confessed to over 90 murders in, in uh, the United States, and over 30 of them have been confirmed. Rangers are contacting agencies all around the United States so they can close their cold cases connected to Little. We will be able to get justice for victims, families from all across the country. Officials say investigators from more than a dozen states are pursuing cases in their jurisdiction. A 35-year period starting in 1970 where he began uh, strangling women and as a result we anticipate that a lot of cold cases in this country will be solved. By the time we're done, we anticipate that Samuel Little will be recognized as the most prolific serial killer in American history. For now, Little will be held in Wise County after an agreement was made with officials in Ector County. That's according to a release. For more information on this case, go to our website, yourbasin.com. Live in the studio, Haley Brooks, Fox 24 News. All right, Haley.